Thank you for watching this Hexagon Geospatial eTraining module, Surface Generation with ImageStation Automatic Elevations DSM. ImageStation Automatic Elevations DSM is a superset of ImageStation Automatic Elevations that combines the classic feature-based matching approach of ISAE for producing digital terrain models with the modern, dense, pixel-level image correlation strategy of semi-global matching or SGM for producing digital surface models. The SGM process creates a very dense point cloud surface file that is stored in LAS format, which is the same format used by LiDAR sensors. The SGM program can also create a rendered version of the point cloud in GeoTIFF image format. In this module, you'll use an existing project to generate surfaces using the SGM program component of ISAD. Start the SGM program by selecting Start, Image Station Automatic Elevations, Image Station Automatic Elevations DSM. Use the Project and Models tab to select the project to open and the models to process. Under the Project Parameters, browse to an existing project. For this example, select Training Automatic Project. From the list of available models, select the models that you want to process and click Add. You can also select models graphically by checking the Use Footprint Viewer option and selecting the models in the Footprint Viewer. The Auto Generate Collection Boundaries option creates non-overlapping rectangles between models and strips to eliminate duplicate processing. The Blockwise Matching option allows you to graphically select an output area of interest over the project using the Footprint Viewer. The input models to process and collection boundaries are automatically determined and the output surfaces are clipped to the area of interest. The Job Processing tab defines the matching parameters and submits the models for processing. By default, ISAD produces a matched point for every pixel from the input models. You can also choose to produce a matched point for every other, every fourth, or every eighth pixel by selecting from the largest overview to use pull-down list. The low resolution option produces sparsely matched point cloud files with points at every 32 pixels in image space. This option overrides the largest OV to use option and provides a good way to do a quick check of your work before submitting a large number of jobs for dense matching. Leave the output format set to uncompressed LAS. You can also select compressed LAZ, which is 10 to 20 percent smaller but takes longer to read in downstream applications. Check Generate Raster to produce a rasterized version of the point cloud in GeoTIFF image format with a true ortho perspective that eliminates building lean and straightens bridges. Leave the resolution set to 5 cm, which is the default for this dataset. The Generate Subsample Point Cloud option can be be used to produce a secondary set of reduced resolution point cloud files for quick viewing. Leave the output folder set to Training Automatic SGM Out. Begin processing by clicking Add Jobs and then Submit Local.
The processing is multi-threaded and can also be distributed to multiple computers using HT Condor. Click Cancel to dismiss the dialog while processing continues. After processing is complete, the resulting point cloud and image files can be viewed in any viewer that supports such formats, such as Erdas Imagine or GeoMedia. Thank you for watching this e-training module from Hexagon Geospatial. For more e-training, please visit hexagongeospatial.com.